ever wonder what life could be? If we could recharge our brains, reset them. Toxic love, fake friends, forget them. To throw bad memories to the wind and watch them fly rather than keep them in our brains and collect them. A little more love and a little less hate. Free talking, free thinking, uncontrolled by the states of our minds that are programmed to pay the rent nine to five, no sleep or opportunity, craving the human connection of a close-knit community, but are blinded by the glare of a screen breathing social insecurity. Filters and Photoshop reminded us of every damn impurity. So we buy into the product, we join the cult of self-obsession, because a photo with a hundred likes is bound to cure depression, and everyone's an addict sitting somewhere on the spectrum, but then socially we pass it on to our kids, then wonder why we can't protect them. We try to teach them to practice self-care. But how can you care for yourself when the only version you know of yourself is the online fictitious counterfeit you created yourself? Because I'm a stranger to myself and that's a danger to my health that the person I'm supposed to know the most gathers dust on the shelf. I'm never really present in the moment. If you're lucky, you'll get half of me. My attention elsewhere because I posted funny shit on Facebook and I like it when people are barely now laugh at me. <laughs> and then I lower my integrity. I let people inside me that cannot see the light in me. Instead, they furthered in the darkness that is rife in every part of me. It's a warped society. We spend longer recharging our phones than recharging ourselves. Swap beautiful moments for ugly ones. And now choose to be treated with disrespect because we've branded ourselves the unlucky ones. And it's that kind of inner conversation that breeds such negative physical manifestation. If there's two embers glowing in your shadows, then you're on the verge of change. I've come to the end of my chapter, so it's time to turn the page and stand centre stage to tell me, do you ever wonder what life could be? If we could recharge our brains, reset them, self-doubt and oppression, forget them, to throw bad memories to the wind and open our eyes and see every beautiful thing that was meant for them. I don't know about you, but I ain't done yet. Because I've seen my future self and I'm in love with myself. So I think it's time I pressed reset. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Woo!